Hey guys, Dean from Hellacious. Back to the videos. I know we haven't posted things in a little bit. Um, so fresh back from Blade Show. Wanted to talk about an exciting new uh, partner of ours. We, we picked up the Tactile brand, uh, which includes Tactile Turn Pens and Tactile Knife Company. So uh, I'm gonna show you both today. Uh, we're excited to have another American made partner. Um, you guys may not know, but you will now that we're getting ready to move uh, to a new location, uh, just a couple doors down from where we're at, but it's about four times the size and space. So we're looking at bringing on additional life makers uh, in the U.S. to help fill out that space, as well as you know increasing the number of firearms and suppressors that we have in store. So with that, we'll get into it. Uh, we'll start with the knives. Uh, we'll start with the rock wall. Uh, you can see here, beautiful knife. Uh, all titanium. Uh, this one is DLC, also has the flamed thumb studs here. Uh, all of the mag all the knives are magnet cut, so um, excellent edge retention, corrosion resistance, um, just an overall uh, nice steel. As you guys know, magnet cut's the new super steel of the world. Um, it is great, but you know, I also think that S45, M390, XHP, uh, Nitro V are also very good knife uh, blade choices. So this is a frame lock, as you can see here, um, just really nice action, um, flips open as you would expect uh, for a knife of this cost. Just to give you some of the measurements, uh, the blade is about three inches and the overall knife is about seven inches. So easily carried. Uh, the pocket clip on this is really great. Uh, I like smaller pocket clips myself, uh, ones that don't like hang all the way halfway down the knife. Um, what's nice about this is, is enough to get the job done, uh, plus it uh, doesn't take away from the aesthetics of the knife. The pocket clip is very stout, uh, so you don't have to worry about this guy coming out of your pocket. Uh, so these are $3.99. Uh, Excellent value for the money in that price point, especially with all titanium DLC magna cut and flamed uh, accents. So that is the rock wall. Next, we're gonna talk about the Maverick. Uh, you know, one of my favorite knives. I actually bought one of their limited edition at Blade Show for myself. I've been carrying it ever since. Uh, just to try them out, see how they hold up. Uh, I'll tell you that, uh, you know, I've in the shop, I cut everything from boxes to, you know, sometimes we have to make little uh, corrections in some of the wood stuff that we have here. So I use it for that, um, food, <laughs> just day-to-day -day stuff. Uh, and the edge, I haven't touched the edge and it's still razor sharp. Uh, this one comes in my Carta. And what's interesting here, I'll get it up here so you can see it on the camera. Uh, the pivot is actually milled to follow the lines of the scale. So again, more attention to detail. Um, just on both sides, I mean, it's excellent. You can see here on the other side, it does the same thing. Uh, so this will look uh, a lot like a Benchmade to folks from an axis lock perspective. Uh, it is axis lock-ish. Uh, I did ask the, the guys, you know, Will and the guys there why uh, they chose this. Uh, they said they love the, the, the kind of axis lock uh, that Benchmade has, but also they took their twist on it, made it more stout, uh, stronger spring, uh, so they felt, you know, they've taken the, uh, the knife to another level. So uh, I will tell you, uh, the action on these knives is very, very good. Um, you know, you can flick them out like that. Um, you know, once they break in, they do get drop shutty, and I'll show you on the Maverick, another Maverick here in a minute. But you can see that it does have that very good uh, closing action. Um, so you, you know, you know it's well made. Again, Magna Cut measurements. Uh, just under three and a half on the blade here, eight inches overall. Uh, again, very nice carry. Uh, same type of clip. So they follow that same thing uh, from the rock wall. They did raise it up here a little bit. So if you do have thick pants, uh, this will accommodate those as well. So really nice job on this. Uh, 249 on this guy. Uh, hard to find a knife uh, with micarta, with the milling, with the accents this thing has. Uh, at that price point. So excellent value for the money. Uh, again, very good carry knife EDC. All right, then I'll get into um, the other Maverick. So they come in two flavors. This is the all titanium. This one has the blue pivot. Uh, again, I'll get it up here. You can actually see how it's milled in there too. Uh, they do have blue standoffs back here, 
which are a nice accent, same clip, all titanium, uh, same measurements. Uh, this one is uh, $299. So uh, again, excellent value for the money. Uh, I would dare you to find an all titanium US made knife with magna cut with this kind of accent at that uh, dollar figure. All right, guys, enough of the knives. Let's get into the pens. Uh, we'll start. Uh, they do have a, a line of pens uh, that are brass, copper, and titanium. Uh, this is the brass. You can see, um, love the bold action here. Uh, if you are a fidget spinner person, this is for you. So uh, very smooth. You can tell the pen uh, has, has uh, small ridges milled into it. I'm going to try to get that in there. Um, so it's grippy, so it's not going to slide out of your hand. Uh, and again, American made, hundred bucks. So again, I was at Blade Show where I saw some of the pen makers uh, selling, you know, their brass and, and copper pens and titanium pens for, you know, three to eight times that amount of money. Uh, so if you have a pen lover in your family that likes uh, elegant writing instruments with an unusual action, uh, these these are it. Uh, size on this is five and a half inches. Weight, two ounces, just an overall awesome pen. Uh, they are refillable, so you can uh, obviously refill the pen uh, with standard, you know, I think they're Schaefer's um, or Pilot's, but it can be refilled. Then we'll bring on the copper, one of my favorites. Uh, same exact pen, just copper. Um, it does weigh a little bit more. I'll show you that here in a second. But uh, as you can see, the copper accents are really nice. Weight on this guy, 2.2 ounces. So not much heavier than the brass. Unfortunately, guys, I don't have any titaniums. Uh, I sold out. Um, again, the, the, all of them are 100 bucks. So they go quick. Um, so the titanium one is considerably lighter, obviously, than both of these pens. Um, then we'll get into the 8-bit. So uh, well, they introduced these at Blade Show. Um, you know, he said he was inspired by the hour, countless hours of playing video games. Uh, so he, you know, modeled the colors after what he felt was a good representation of uh, back when the old games were uh, just a few colors. So you can see here this one uh, has, you know, you push the pet button down, obviously the pen comes out. Uh, you press this to retract. So another good fidget pen for those that uh, dig that kind of stuff. These are Cerakoted. Uh, I do like the gray and orange a lot, uh, especially with the, uh, the the red accent here on the button. 149 bucks on these guys. Uh, length, five and three quarters. Weight, 0.9 ounces. Uh, just an overall great everyday carry pen. I do have it in a uh, orange and gray, same kind of action uh, on these. Uh, just a little shorter in size. Uh, this one's five and a quarter versus five and three quarters. Um, but again, excellent pen weight, 1.2 ounces. So if you like uh, snazzy uh, colors like this, this is certainly will be a conversation piece when you whip this out uh, at your next uh, work meeting where you're taking notes uh, or uh, you're just doing your daily journaling. That's it, guys, for Tactile Turn. Um, you know, again, I think it's an amazing brand. Uh, really enjoy uh, them being made in the U.S. Uh, they do have a great uh, set of knives and pens at, at a very inexpensive price. Excellent value for the money. Uh, glad we picked them up. Can't wait to, uh, you know, continue to show these to our folks as they walk through the door. You can get these on our website at uh, www.hellacious.com. That's H-E-L-A-C-I-O-U-S.com. You can reach us in the store at 800-936-3280 uh, uh, or on any social media platform. We're here to help. Uh, so give us a call or hit us up and we'll ship these out next day to you. Take care, guys, and I'll see you on the next one.